Hi everyone, welcome back to Life with Crumbs, or if you're new, welcome, my name is Tanya. Thanks so much for being here. Today I am sharing with you an Aldi haul. I did have to break quarantine to go out and get some essentials, so I made a couple of stops. One of those was to one of my favorite stores, which is Aldi. I absolutely love shopping there, I just don't get there very often. In fact, prior to today, I believe it was December when I was there last, and before that, um, I think it was August. So. Like I said, I don't get there often, so this definitely was a stock up type trip. So let's go ahead and jump in. Okay, so starting over here with produce, just picked up some celery, great for snacks, great for soups, casseroles, things like that. This is my all time favorite salad kit that they sell. It's the sunflower chopped salad kit. Um, it's got the cabbage, kale, um, what does it say? Lettuce, carrots, edamame, sunflower seeds. Absolutely love it. It's something I always grab for every time I'm there. Also grabbed a couple of Caesar salad kits. These are great for lunches or um, even as an addition to an evening meal. Throw some chicken in them. They're great. Grab some baby carrots. The kids like snacking on those or again for lunches, whatnot. Um, grabbed mushrooms. I like to do omelets with mushrooms or for having steak. Um, do that as a side. We are going to be doing a Mexican meal one night, so that brings me to the cilantro and also the jalapenos. And then had to pick up some berries. They looked too good to pass up, so I got some raspberries, blueberries, and blackberries. Over in the freezer section, I picked up a couple potato options. The kids have been asking for tater tot casserole, so I got the potato puffs to make that and some crinkle cut fries that will go really good with um, burgers one night. I got these croissant sandwiches. There are four of them to a box. They are sausage, egg, and cheese. Pop those in the microwave for a quick little breakfast. Um, Texas toast we really like. That goes great with a anything really. Um, but the kids like to make little mini pizzas out of them. Add some sauce and some cheese, some pepperoni. They've got their own little mini pizza. Uh, picked up these black Angus bacon and cheddar burgers. They looked really good and just a convenience um, for me really um, for a night where I don't feel like doing a lot of prep. I can just um, cook those up and throw some fries in the oven and call it good. Um, picked up some French toast sticks. I thought these would be a good um, alternative for breakfast. They're kind of getting sick of cereal and toast. So this is just another breakfast option for them. The Baby Bell cheeses. Two of my kiddos really love snacking on those. So that was a great option for them to have around. Bagels. I've got one of my kiddos who adores bagels. I really love the um, Lovin' Fresh bagels. They're nice and soft. Um, they're not like chewy or hard, I guess, as compared to some bagels that we've had in the past. So those are delicious. Um, picked up salsa because who doesn't love salsa? Again, this will go with our um, meal or even just um, some chips. I picked up two jars of the marinara. Um, I would have definitely picked up more, but they were placing a limit to only two per person. So I um, obeyed that rule and did not grab more than my share. I picked up these um, egg thins for myself. Um, I do keto, and so these are a great alternative to bread or a tortilla. Um, so these are pretty versatile for me in a variety of ways, so those are for me. Again, this is just another shortcut meal, just some burger patties, um, 75-25. Um, and again, just an easy, quick meal option for us. I uh, picked up some unsweetened uh, vanilla flavored almond milk. Again, that is for me. Uh, fits well with my keto lifestyle. I use it on a keto cereal and also use it to mix up some keto uh, type shakes. And picked up this Yo Crunch um, yogurt for my two littlest guys. They really like these. So we got the Oreo and the M&M flavor. Picked up some cheese puffs, just a little snack for them to have around. Um, did need quite a bit of pasta, so we got both. I uh, got the rotini as well as the elbow macaroni and also the spaghetti. 
I picked up this bag of trail mix that is another snack favorite amongst our kids. It's a one pound bag that should last us a little while. Um, unsweetened applesauce pouches. Those are a good snack to have around, nice and convenient. Don't have to worry about things getting spilled. Um, the Savor It's cheese crackers are really good. They remind me very much of the Cheese It crackers. Um, I don't notice a difference. However, the price for these are much better than what you're gonna pay at a normal store for the Cheez Its. Next up, we have all of these muffins and brownies. We've got the blueberry muffins, um, the brownies, and the chocolate chip muffins. These are a favorite of my daughter's. We've got the yogurt bites. These are for my two-year-old. He still really enjoys these as a treat, so it's nice to have them around. Um, I would say when we're on the go, but we're not really going anywhere these days. Um, but they were a really nice thing to have when we were on the go or heading to church or something like that. I didn't have to worry about him making a big mess with something like crumbs with like crackers or anything like that. So always good to have the yogurt bites on hand. We have a plethora of cookie options down here. Like I said, this is a lot of junk food, but it is a stock up trip. Like I said, I haven't been there for four months, so I've got a couple of different packages of the chewy chocolate chip cookies, two packages of the original sandwich cookies that are very similar to the Oreos. And then we've got the peanut butter wafers and then a couple boxes of the Swiss rolls. Also have five boxes of the Sims uh, meat snacks. My boys really love snacking on these. So I've got three packages of the mild smoked snack sticks and two of the original. And there are 14 sticks per box. So those should last quite a while. Also picked up some cinnamon applesauce cups only because this cinnamon is just the plain unsweetened. And some of the kids like the cinnamon and some of them don't. So that's why I buy both. And then we also have some raisins, so. Okay everyone, that's gonna do it for today's video. Like I said, this looks like a lot of junk food, but really it was a stock up trip. I'm not getting there very often, or really getting anywhere very often these days. So, thank you so much for being here. I hope that you enjoyed. If you did, please remember to give this video a like, subscribe if you are new, and leave me a comment below and let me know what your favorite items to pick up at Aldi are. All right, everyone, I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Bye for now.